Okay. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to The Breakfast Club, where science, politics, and religion all collide, and we find out who we really are. So we're going to get up close and personal today, and we're going to figure some things out. So let's go. All right. All right. Just so you know, that's what's for breakfast. We need to find our first victim. Hello, sir. What's your name? Jojo. His name's Jojo. What team are you in? Magnolia. Magnolia. Mangolia. Okay. What's your name? This is this is in the name of science. I need to know your name. We need to document it correctly. Michael. Michael. What team are you in, Michael? Hemlock. Hemlock. Great to hear, mate. We've got our next victim, guys. Hello. Ha! First question I want to ask you is, what is that? What? What is in that cup? Is that your breakfast? Do we want to see her drink it? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Give out one sip. Just a sip. Hey! Okay, what is your name? Hazel. What team are you a part of? Redwood. Is it a good team? Yeah. Is it better than Rosewood? Obviously. Okay, what is your name? Chelsea. What team are you a part of? Jitterbox. The best team. Okay, if you win a fight against Bob the Builder, who would win? I'd win. Why would I'd you win? win. I, look at me. I'm like twice the size. It's fair call, cool, but he's got a hammer. Yeah, and I got my fist. Fair call, cool, fair call. Cool. 10 years of boxing. Me. You would win? You said that with a level of confidence. Explain to me why you're confident. He's weak. What's special about Michael that you're going to beat Bob the Builder in a fight? Because I'm strong. Because you're, you're strong. All right, I'll take it. Me, for sure. Why would you win? Bob the Builder is just trash. Fighting? Uh, fighting, he just sucks. I respect it. Okay. Mm, probably him, because he's got all the tools. That's our first Bob the Builder win, really. Everyone else has said they would win. Okay, I respect it. The question I'm about to ask you is purely in the name of science. What was the color of your last pee? From like clear to the color of Yarra Valley Hilltop apple juice. <laughs> okay, it was a bit yellow. A bit yellow, like are we talking like that apple juice yellow? No, 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 not that bad, not that bad. It was, you could tell it's yellow. Okay. That yellow. I need you to have a look at Claire's jacket over there. Compared to that jacket, I don't look at my pee. She doesn't look at her pee. What was the colour of your last pee? You, you don't want to know. <laughs> what is the quadratic formula? Have a go. Red? Red? <laughs> it's the colour red. You go like that. And you put a plus. And then you put numbers at the top. You put numbers at the bottom. Decimal point, numbers. You draw a line. You take away. You take away the numbers that you had up there, and then that's your final answer. Then you divide it, and then that's your answer. Uh, in terms of like socioeconomic small communities, specifically within like metropolitan areas, you're seeing a lot of that. So you see a lot of rise of homelessness, housing crisis in my hometown right now of Toowoomba. The reality is because of globalization and a economic wealth on the rise, you're starting to see that really putting people in really hard areas to be. You know what I mean? Uh, we need to find some type of solution towards the, ho the housing crisis and ways to boost economics, personally. I reckon we vote Grant for Prime Minister of Australia. I am ready for service. You're awesome. Thank you. No, you gotta, you gotta copy me, you're awesome. Oh, yeah, sorry, you're awesome. <laughs> you're amazing. You're amazing. You're the best leader ever. You're the best Isaac ever. Oh, hear that, Woodrow, brother? <sighs> Show us your go-to dance move. Can you beatbox for me? Nice, nice. Yeah, get a bit of those hips into it. Uh, uh, uh. And then you do, ready? Go back. Uh. Okay, that was good. Well done, Michael. Uh, yes.
Thank you everybody for watching. I hope you have grown, grown like a juniper plant. See you guys later, peace.